How's it everyone? Welcome back to Beyond the Coast. Look at the weather in the background, it's mint. We've just pulled over on the side of the road. We're heading up the coast camping for a night. We're gonna get up there, set up the tent, cook some burgers, and then we're gonna go land based fishing in the morning and try catch a big snapper. So let's get into it, eh? All right, people, we have arrived. Let's check this place out. It's pretty epic. So nice. Man. There's hardly anyone here either. Yeah, I've camped here once. This is Jane's first time here, but check it out. There's there's a few campers along down here, but I mean, it's far from packed. Check it. And we, tomorrow, are going to walk around the beach to the end up over along that hill down that dip up there and then over and drop down the back sorry <laughs> i told you there's a hill involved you were very very loose on the details <laughs> for a reason yeah <laughs> all right this is epic as you can see the sun is hissing but we don't have much of it left so um let's set up camp eh let's do it How's this team? So we've just pulled the rooftop tent out. Um, one of our earlier videos was what the second time we've used it. So this is the third time we've opened it and we've just undone it. And I don't know what's going on, but it's bent as like, it's like someone's been on the roof of our wagon jumping on the rooftop top tent or something. We don't have, we never put anything up there, but like that's rub marks from, you can't even see it like, oh, look at, look at how, it is up in there. But it's all in line with the ladder, like this, this is where the ladder sits. Yeah, it's um, it's where the ladder is, but it's like someone's been up there jumping on it or something. It's buggered, it's so warped and bent. It's, oh, that's disappointing. She's a bit wonky and crinkly under under the side. It's, I just got up here and pretty much jumped on it and, and got one of those big bends out. But yeah, she's got a big kink in it. It's not the best. 
it's where the ladder's been sitting on this side here and it's just been rubbing but it's all strapped down really tight i just don't understand how it gets that much movement in there but it must just be real light vibrations but we'll pull the tent off now and just put it on when we go camping won't drive around with it on all right the sun has just gone down behind the hill we've probably only got 45 minutes of light left so um let's set up the rest of this camp and get cooking starving <sighs> All right, team, what a setup. Full beachfront. Jane's stoked. Rooftop tents buggered. <laughs> it's, not <funny. laughs> it's, not, it's not healthy. You can see up under here where it's been rubbing. And there, there, I jumped on the big kink in there and flattened that out, but yeah, we're doing it. All right, we're not having anything too exciting for dinner tonight. We just didn't have the time. We just finished work. It took us ages to pack the car and we just needed to get up here as soon as possible and just wanted to get here set up and dinner cooked before dark. So um, we've got about half an hour. We're going to make some, what do we got? Some chicken, chicken burgers. We're going to make chicken burgers anyway. So let's get into it. Coconut and lemongrass crumb tenders. Oh, that one's. How's old camera guy here just sitting slurping? How good? Oh, the actual, I thought it was gonna be a bit swellier up here than it is, but that's probably a good thing because ain't hey, nobody got time to get swept off the rocks tomorrow. We've got heaps of fresh bait, heaps of burley, and we're gonna get into it first thing in the morning. It's gonna be mean. And this, these burgers smell mint. We're doing it, I'm pumped. We would stay, we're only here for the one night. We would have stayed longer, but it's forecasted pissed down tomorrow Arvo so we're gonna go fishing get back I don't know have lunch here if it's still nice and then head back down the coast look at it how you getting on oh. get it go on where is it Well, we are on here. She right. making me a burger. What would you like? Everything. Everything, please. Chicken, red onion, avocado, tomato sauce. Damn it, we forgot the chili stuff. Um, and lettuce, please. These burgers look so good. Well, let me get up in there. Yeah, Dumna. So this campground we're at, it's a dock camp, so you can't bring dogs. Otherwise, Peppy would be here having burgers with us. I'll give you the less Oh, I, I'm easy. I'm easy. Man will eat whatever. Uh, sauce? Yes, please. Is that alright? That's great. How's that for you? A bit that's, more? No, that's great. Thank you. Hold that up for a team. Yeah, yeah. See, she can cook. Pull it up. Oh, how good. 
That's a good burger, that's big. Crispy. Crispy goodness? Mm. That's mean. Good. I'm gutted we forgot the beetroot. Oh yeah, that beetroot would have made it, make but it's still mean. Yeah. It's real good. I definitely go those patties again. Cool. Mm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Heaps of room, eh? Yeah. Heaps of room. I'm coming in. It's a bit of an upgrade for it when I hold that. Yeah. Um, yeah. We're doing it. I'm in. I'm coming in. I'm trying to keep the mosquitoes out and I'm coming in. Oh. I'm in. Alright, guys. See ya. Peace. <laughs> We're out of here. See you in the morning. We'll go fishing. Ooh. I'm up, people. Um, good sleep. Yes, finally. The rooftop tent's where it's at. It's a lot comfier than the uh, than the tent. Just gonna put the burner on and make a coffee. So let's get into it, eh? Ooh. Here you go. Yeah. There? We're on here, team. That'll start us off. Super overclass. I'm not gonna lie. There's a few raindrops, but don't tell Jay. And I just used all the gas making coffee. So I don't know how we're going to make breakfast. Oh, alright people, I'm not going to lie. I had my coffee, started getting really windy and rainy and I got back in the tent and went to sleep. Not to worry, the tides were wrong anyway. We needed to wait for the tide to drop a bit to get to this spot. So I've just got back out. Um, Jane's just getting down now. We're going to pack the gear and uh, get into it. It's so hot. It's looking mean. It's overcast, cloudy, a little bit windy, a little bit washy. Perfect conditions for snapper fishing. We're into it, people. Quite the walk ahead. Let's do it. All right, team, we've opted for keeping feet dry, but that means we have to take the stairs. So we're just coming up on them now. I've only done these stairs once, but I remember it was an absolute killer with a big pack on. There's quite a few steps involved. Right, we're about to get into it. About a quarter of the way up, full blown. Oh, it burns. Yeah, blow the cobwebs out, that's for sure. I see, not this little point here, but the second point there, the real steep one. I think, oh no, this point in here, that's where I took her down last time, real steep. Not, not a good idea. You can see why I don't have any trust in 
Look, I haven't done you wrong yet. You have. I haven't. So many times. Nothing's ever happened. I don't even think you've ever got a scratch. If anybody falls over, it's me. Oh. Last little bit, team, and we're down on the rocks. <sighs> oh, he almost got. <sighs> Honestly, if you're not from New Zealand and you haven't seen this stuff before, flax, it's so strong, you hang on to that stuff, it does not pull out. Did I say that right? Does that sound right? It doesn't come out of the ground easy. <laughs> All right, we're here. So we're just, we're just putting the burley in the water and I'm just gonna explain this to you guys because I know we get a lot of viewers from America and stuff like that. Burley, it's pretty much frozen charm you buy it here or once we get into the heat of winter, I'll start making my own, but it's just ground up fish and, and shellfish and stuff just to attract it the fish in so just put it in a in a bag like that a netted bag and just hang it in the water and it defrosts it's in plastic at the moment and i've just got a few holes in there so it just slowly disperses out i just drop that in the water here and on a really good day on a day kind of like this when it's a bit overcast and a bit dirty and stuff you'll get big snapper come in and uh feed off the burly bag or feed under it and you get to see them it's pretty epic so i like to when i first get to my spot put my burley in the water and just sit here for about five minutes and really shake it up and get it get it working already i can see the oil and bits of fish coming out because i've got like a one that i used last week in there so i half defrosted one and that's just going everywhere look at it all all right we're on the rock jane's across we've got all the bait across jane's just going to rig up the first bait and put one out see what's happening see if there's any fish biting out there Weather's beautiful, windy, raining, we love it. the line will loop you around the rock. On team, second bait. Oh no! Kawai. Big kawai for fresh bait. We just bring a lot of bait through. That'll definitely help. We pick kawai for bait. bait. She's on. Get it. Carwine? Oh, we need more bait anyway, so that's wheat. Ooh. Nice. Whoa. Alright, nah, it's cool, mean fresh bait, so we need heaps of fresh bait. So. <laughs> Zone! A lot of pickers, eh? Oh, so many pickers. Where's the dog? Wonder if it's a bit too calm and chilled in here. Well, or any wash. Nah. Biggest of the day so far. That's all right. That's a good snap. Yeah, yeah. Mate. Oh, another nice snap. A few bit of runs coming on. The bite time was a bit later, so it might be starting to happen. I'm 
with a nice snap, about the same size as Jane's one. Look at that. Hey. Might be starting to happen, team. And the rain stopped. We're looking up, it's positive. Nice. That one's on top. Should we let that one go? Yeah. That was a bit of a drop. See you later, mate. She's hooked up. Way better. Where's it going? Almost pulled you off the rocks. Let's try and keep it away from that rock out in the middle. The old slow run, eh? It's not like foul hooks and just coming in on the side. Nah, it pulled pretty hard. Oh, he's trying to get into that rock. Oh, right, here it comes. Yeah, nice snap. Real nice snap. So this team. The better one. Yeah, that one. If you um, hold that as well, I'll land this. Oh, yeah. Epic. Just the slow, casual pick up and run off, eh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, hold there because I'm like down. That's epic. Oh, look at that. It's a good moocher. Definitely not even close to a PB for Jane. She's caught some horse snaps off the rocks, but that's a really nice fish. Hold oh, on, good fish. Gone. Well done. Let the walk in. <laughs> we back. We back at camp. <sighs> buggered. Buggered. It's just rained again. Tents all wet. <clears throat> We're just packing it away. It's right. We'll air it out in a few days when it um, dries out. When the weather clears up. Look, you can see this big dent in it now. Yeah, it's right where the ladder is. Yeah. Holy. <laughs> How do you feel? <laughs> oh, we're all packed up, we're in the car. Um, we're heading down the we're heading down the coast for a coffee. Let's go. Been great, but we're done. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. It it's was such only a nice spot, but it's like real wet and rainy and windy, and and, and this is why sick. we're yeah. This is why we're only doing one night too, because from now on, let's say we'll start really packing in. Whew, all right, let's go get a coffee and a cake. Oh, oh, people just arrived home. Look, there she blows. The boat's all gutted because she got left behind. Um, oh. That's pretty much it from us. Um, nothing too crazy this week, but the weather was pretty average, but um, still managed to get out there and do something. Still a good weekend away or a couple of days away, but um, yeah, we're pretty buggered. We've got a lot of wet, smelly gear to wash, so we're <laughs> gonna leave it there. Jane's feeling under the weather, so she's pretty keen to get on the couch and under a blankie. Um, once again, thanks for watching. Um, we'll try and get out and do it all again next week. Leave us a message and uh, yeah, we'll get back to you.